Hi, and welcome back to Down the Shed. This is a really quick uh, test, really, just for the recording abilities of the webcam on the laptop via MCA software. So, I had, I think it was version 10.45 I've been using for God knows how long since that was the last version I updated to anyway. I've been using this software for about three, well, since I started the channel, basically. Um, it wants me to update it to the latest version, 13.45, but when you do that, you have to pay, not quite as much as the original license, but you have to pay for the upgraded license, so you get a bit of a discount. This is absolutely disgusting. If you're going to keep flipping, making me keep upgrading software, then don't keep charging me for it. So basically, if you've got a software license for NCH VideoPad, <clears throat> it'll be um, usable for that prefix. So basically, my VideoPad key, license key, is only good for versions 10.00 to 10.99. I think it goes up to 10.96 this version I've just up upgraded to so I couldn't use my webcam on 10.45 the second it uh, booted up it would just freeze and lock out the entire software and I'd have to reboot the um, video pad software so I've upgraded now to I think it's 10.96 or 10.84 and as you can see the video software you can't see that the video software is working perfectly I'll just show you why I keep looking over there because I've got a big ass 40 inch 2160p high definition monitor it's uh, Amazon Fire TV it was used in our shop as one of the menu displays but they've upgraded them to proper um, display shop displays so I bought one of these off them and Grand Theft Auto 5 on that screen is absolutely amazing I love it it's awesome so in the last week I've bought myself uh, well, in the last eight days so a week ago yesterday I bought the Acer Nitro 5 second hand from a company I'm not going to mention because their customer service was absolutely piss poor uh, 420 pounds I then got the big screen which I'm paying 254. I haven't even looked at the price of it. He offered me a price. I was happy to pay it. It's only money. Um, and a cheapy Argos Android wired Xbox controller. So this one ain't Bluetooth or anything. It just literally plugs into the. Uh, you see it look light on. Literally just plugs into the USB. Happy days. Does the job. Um, so basically, the brand new version of that computer in Argus would be 800 quid, and I've paid 695 for the computer. The big ass screen, which if I wire it up to my TV area on the roof of the shed, I can actually get TV on. Uh, it's got the YouTube and Amazon and all that crap on there. I literally want it as a PC monitor. That is it. I could connect it. I don't know, has that one got HDMI out on it? No, I don't think it has. So it has a version of HDMI out, but it needs an adapter to work. I don't remember if I ever bought one, to be fair. But anyway, this was just a quick test. I'm just going to bang this out without any editing. All I wanted to do was make sure that the... I keep looking at the big screen, because I can't see the little one over there. Is to make sure that the um, recording software is doing its job properly which it now is, it's not freezing, which means I'm back to where I was with a fully functioning uh, video editing software suite, which is happy days. I don't need version 13.45. Well, I'm not saying I don't need it, I'm just not prepared to pay for an upgrade license when I don't need to, because this does what I need it to do. So I shall see you soon in whatever the next video is going to be. I need to tidy this shit hole up in my shed. Um, we should get a Christmas a Christmas video out for that. 0.25s, yeah, I think I've rest of either 0.28s now, I'm not sure, can't remember. But 
Yeah, happy days. So, see you soon.